Ask me this one more time, I probably pee on myself. I, I was that scared, I was terrified, bro. And it was daylight. It wasn't even dark. It was daylight. He had to jump to that extreme. Talking about he was. No, I'm serious. I was scared. Mm -hmm. What's, What's up, up J.O. Mafia? It's your girl, Jazz. And it's your boy, Old. You guys, today we coming with a giant snow crab leg seafood. Boy, Y'all already know. But look, before we get into this video, we need y'all to do a couple things. Just a couple of things. Like this video. Share it up. Comment down below. Hit that notification bell to the bing, to the bing, to the bing. And don't, don't forget, forget to subscribe. subscribe. All right, right y'all. Man, look, Jazz went ahead and did a nice little close-up of this goodness. Yes, sir. And we're going to get into that right now. Ooh-wee. Man, look, I don't know about y'all, but doing this voiceover for this making me want to eat the whole video i ain't even gonna lie to y'all man look at the snow crab look at the sauce y'all already know and we got crawfish down there below no let me stop playing but look y'all man oh my god i don't know about y'all but this looks delicious let's get into this video right now good all right all right, y'all. So y'all already know. Look, every couple videos, mm -hmm. we about to try out a new seasoning. What we okay? got today? So today we got Weber All Purpose Cookout. Okay. That's literally what it is. So it's savory, mm -hmm. um, garlicky, <laughs> gar garlicky, mm -hmm. buttery seasoning. So. Okay. All purpose. So I oh, guess yeah, you can put perfect. this on a little bit of everything. A little bit of steak. A little bit of yeah, uh, burgers, chicken, ribs, yep, veggies. Yep, works on everything. It don't say seafood, so we gonna give y'all an honest review. Yep, and then y'all can literally click the link below and grab y'all Weber. Yes, sir. All purpose season. Mm -hmm. So I'm about to go ahead and do that right now. Hi. Right. Okay. We gonna we, pour it up. We gonna try. We gonna try. <coughs> Ooh, all right. What we grabbing? What you grabbing? What's up? Oh man, look, I'm ready to go in. Look, I'm about to grab this corn, bro. All right, I'm about to dip it. Oh, let me show y'all that real quick. There go the sauce. <coughs> the famous Otis sauce. Right, oh. All right, oh, y'all. Oh my God. As y'all know, we're going to get the grub in. Let me take my ring off. We're going to get the grub in, then we're going to get into this topic. Look, y'all, man, y'all already know. Yeah, boy. It's hungry. And I'm gonna do this. Oh shoot. Are we doing the countdown? Yeah, we're gonna do a countdown. We gonna do a countdown. How that sound, y'all? Better open that thing up. I'm ready to grub. All right. All right, let's do this countdown. So we gonna do this in one, two, three. Yeah, I swear. Hey. That's hitting. Mm-hmm. That's that, some good flavor right there. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. You can definitely taste the buttery. Mm-hmm. And we got a little bit of crawfish in there as well, too. Mm-hmm. We added some crawfish. Cause we didn't um, use the whole bag in the last um, crawfish boil, so. Man. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm. Hopefully everybody had an amazing week. Look y'all. This right here. 100% busting bro. Give me a good old rub 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 rub. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, for real, for real. This is good. This is all the way good. Mm. Wow. It's something about <sighs> that corn, bro. What you gotta do, I'm gonna tell y'all. I guess I can kind of call myself a seafood um, professional. No, I'm just playing. But, I can say this, how you get that seasoning mm -hmm. to really hit, when it's done cooking, 
turn it off. Alright? Turn it off. Take the water off the eye so it's not continuing getting hot. It's mm -hmm. going to cool down. But leave the seafood up in the water. If we got lemons, y'all. We have it for the next one, we promise. Leave it in the water for at least 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. What that's going to do, it's going to give it that flavor. Mm -hmm. This tastes so good, make you want to slap a jazz. I swear to God. <laughs> That'd be the last thing he do. Oh. What's up? You want to get smacked? No. Nope. You don't want to get smacked? You must want to end up with two black eyes, huh? No. I'm going to call you Chris Brown if you do that. Feel me? Mm. Don't put your hands on me. Damn, little fat head dude. Look, y'all. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's something about this flavor, bro. Amazing. Amazing. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm. I'm going to tell y'all. When we first started doing seafood, mm hmm. People used to be like, y'all not eating it right. Over the years, I learned there's not a certain way you eat seafood. As long as you eat them, that's what matters. No, some people about to be mad. I see them typing right now. <laughs> I see. Look, I see them. They like. First of all, yeah, it is. Look. Well, I don't feel it is. Look. Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. Look. You know, er, you know, since social media came out, everybody's some gangsters. <laughs> no, that's in the last, like, that's in like the mid to late two thousands. Let's talk about it. Do you think social media? Make people gangster. A lot of times, yeah. I, I feel like a lot of things that I see people say, not only in our comments, but like in other people's comments, that you, they probably would never say it to their face, right? But some of them probably would. No, some, some people would. I'm not saying that for everybody. I'm saying for a lot of people. Like, they probably would be like, the same people being like, oh. Look, I come from the era Probably. of not talking. To, we don't do all that talking. If you get my drill. Probably the same people that's trolling. That's all I'm saying. You know, I'm going to tell y'all, in life, you got to live it to the fullest, bro. Yes, don't, worry, don't worry about what somebody um, say. And this ain't the topic of today, so we just yeah, a question. I just wanted to ask, like, because mm -hmm. I was listening to Bigger Pockets, and um, mm -hmm. you know, somebody was saying something like that. I feel like it's hard sometimes to for not some people to separate social media from their real lives sometimes Man, and look. they get too caught up in the sauce <laughs> we don't talk about bro no 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 I ain't gonna lie but I'm the type of person I'm gonna give it a hundred if it gets too much I just delete my stuff take a break come back I won't have no problem with doing that. I ain't never about to fold. Some first. people. Some people aren't. Some people is probably too hard for them to do that. You know what I'm saying? Look. I ain't going to tell you. I'm going to tell you something. It's something about this. Ooh. This thing. 
right? And you gotta. Mm. Oh. I don't know why I always do that. Every wow, time. look at all that. What was that? Look, it got all over me. Why is it white like that? Man, cause it's all this white meat. Oh, okay. You feel me? Anyways. This was a big claw, bro. Y'all ready to get into the topic? Man. I'm about to smell like Mr. Crab in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Bro. What's the topic of today? What's the scariest movie you ever watched? As a child. As a child. Or how, even now, shoot. You know. But I say as first? a I say as a child because I don't know to me, not everybody, but to me personally, scary movies were so much scarier when I was a kid. They were. Well, certain ones. I mean, I'm t trust me. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna jump too quick to say that because this song is pretty scary. Now, I'm just saying. Ooh. What was the scary? Want this corn? Mm -mm. What's the scariest one for you? I gotta think about mine for a second because it's a couple. I'm not trying to think of the, the scariest one. Mm. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. It was axism. Mm -hmm, that was pretty scary. Bro. The part that scared me in that movie mm. is when that girl turned to a spider and she walked backwards. Mm -mm. Bro. We used to live on the third floor. And my mom used to be like, go get the mail. Oh, no. This after we, like, I watched that movie. I ain't gonna lie, bro. She used to be like, go get the mail. I used to be like, man, I used to be scared, bro. I used to be like, man, if she asked me this one more time, I'd probably pee on myself. I, I was that scared. I was terrified, bro. And it was daylight. It wasn't even dark. It was daylight. He had to jump to that extreme. Talking about he was. No, dead. I'm serious. I was scared. Mm -hmm. And it like it was daylight, but the way the hallways were, mm -hmm. it was dark down there by the oh, mailbox, no. bro. So I went down there and I got the mail, bro. I ran so. fast. Fast up them steps. I know you did. Boy, my mom like, why is you running? Why are you sweating like that? I'm like, mom, I watched that movie. She like, what movie? Exorcism. Mm. That's where he messed up. That movie still scared me to this day. It still scared me to this day too. That's me. one of them movies, boy. You know. Now is it like are you one of those people where like too many not too many movies scare you? Mm-hmm. See, I'm the opposite of that. <laughs> Every scary movie scared me. Except for one. I mean, as a kid it scared me, so I'm I'm gonna take that back. But I would say one of my favorite like scary movies. No, we're talking about one of the scariest. Not one of your favorite. Mm. Anyways, I'm I'm gonna go next before he come up with his next one. Mine, the scariest movie I ever seen was The Wrong Turn. Oh, I was gonna say that too. Bad idea. I was bad, gonna say I was gonna, I was gonna say that too. I was gonna say that too. Bad yeah, idea. The Wrong Turn, boy. I don't know why I watched that Ooh. because I couldn't sleep out of myself for like a week. Hey. You know what? When I think of the wrong turn, it's when I take a road trip, bro. I oh, we be going camping. Hey. Oh, man. Wait, what about that one <laughs> campground we went to? That reminded me of the wrong, wrong turn. I swear and to the God. mosquitoes was big as... <laughs> hey, I ain't even gonna lie. Oh, man. When I go certain places, I said location. <laughs> People be like, why oh, are you sending man. this? I'll be like, look, if I don't come up, 
This my last web out. You feel oh, me? Man, that's crazy. I ain't playing. Man, all I know is. Wow. I could not sleep by myself for a week. You know what? It's not a scary movie. Well, I guess it could be. But Final Destination, bro. Bro. Wait. This is serious. And I'm not joking. Bro. So, okay. I still can't there get is behind no. a truck with logs behind No, it. serious. Like, where we live, there was literally recently... A couple of days ago where it was like a situation like the final destination. It was like a five car pile up. Then somebody got hit by a car. Oh my god, it was it was crazy. Bro. No, I can't do it. No. It, it and they said it happened so quick. Look. Man, that's I don't know how stuff. people get behind them trucks. Oh, this! I thought I could open this. I can't. Man, you already see what happened. They got the juice on me and this, everything. This ain't. It's already halfway open. Man. Oh, there. <sighs> I said it's already halfway open. That should have gave you the cue right then and there. Right. Okay, so yours is Final Destination. Hey, in the comment section below, let us know what was the scariest scary movie you ever watched as a kid or even now. I don't think, like, Annabella, that ain't really scary. What you mean that ain't really scary? Are you serious? Shoot. Look, I almost cussed. Look, that was the scariest stuff. Chucky, not scary. You, feel you me? know what? I thought Chucky was scary as a kid, but now no. Honestly, if Chucky was to run up to me, bro. See, he talking that crap. But he know if a, if a dog start running towards him, it would be go. <laughs> But I say be like, what the f Look, I ain't gonna be one of them girls that like run and they trip over like air. <laughs> you feel me? Like why every movie it gotta be like that? No. Because they so scared. Man scared to my get away. But why the black people don't do it? Come hey, on now. There's some black people that have died. They hey. always die first. So um I was watch anybody that watches American horror stories. 1984, a black guy died in that. I, they thought he got away on the mo motorcycle. On the way out of the campsite, they chopped his head off. See, but he ain't tripped though. <laughs> he thought he was getting out. They sleep. That's what happened. You can even play that back. Sleep. Jazz. That's what happened. That's what it. Sleep. Sleep. <laughs> that's my. <laughs> that's my Howard day. Like that's my slicing sound. That's my sound effect. Ow. You need you need to go play with the eye with that. You need to go play um uh, fruit ninja. <laughs> I don't think none of them sounds say sleep, bro. Wait. That was my sound effect. Sound effect, bogus, bro. <laughs> sleep, sleep. Listen. Come on, bro. Sleep. I'm just saying. You sound like you about to say glee. <laughs> and then um what's the next scary movie? Oh, uh man. I forget what it's called where the the house is hunted and every family that moves in, the dad or the son end up murdering everybody. Or trying. You know what movie I'm talking about? It's called Start with an A. Um it's based out of Connecticut. Um you know what I'm talking about. I just can't think of the name. Oh, I can't think of it. Wait. Not Annabelle. No. It, it's, no. It's, um. Um. Dang. Wow. If anybody know what movie I'm talking about, comment in the comment section below. But let me explain it. So, it's about this family. They move into a house. The son ends up getting possessed. And he ends up murdering the whole entire everybody in the house. Oh, for real? One by one. Parents, siblings. So when the first person died, they didn't move? What the? They, everybody was in that deep sleep. Oh. 
And then I'm sure those kids in the room, I think they got woken up by the, the gunshots. They escaped. Mm-hmm. No. They did it. They didn't at all. Alright. Yeah. It was it was crazy. You know what? This part is gonna sound crazy. Hmm. Well, not really. But a movie that really scares me to this day, Pet Cemetery. You know what? It's something about Pet Cemetery, bro. That is some creepy stuff. <coughs> Pet That's some creepy stuff. It's this um It's this area where we live, like it's called Maribel Caves. So the story behind it is it was a fire that happened at this hotel and no, and pretty much nobody made it out. This was like early 1900s or something like that. But oh, you talking about here here. Mhm. Mm I'm thinking Tom for real. Why well, ain't never hear about this story? No, Maribel Cave. So one time I ain't even going to lie y'all. Interesting. We went there, me and a couple buddies. See, that's some stupid crap. That, that and this auras, right, that flows. It's one of the most haunted places in America. Oh, heck no. So, like, um, one of my friends hopped the fence, and they went up to the, uh, to the building, because some of it still stands. And um, he said he seen something walk. Why would y'all do that? Stupid. Look. Y'all stupid. We must have been disturbing something because my friend, he was in the car. I was outside the car. And um, the car started moving. Like, literally. He he was in the back seat and the car literally started moving. Like backwards? Frontwards. Oh, heck no. And then... Crazy thing, a truck semi was coming, just like Pet Cemetery, bro. It zoomed right by. That's the last time I went. I know that happened to Maribel Caves. See y'all, why y'all playing? Some could have followed y'all, huh? I don't know. But what you mean you don't know? I'm just telling you. I mean, I guess you followed me, you know. <laughs> Did you come from the cave? <coughs> Did I? Am I really here? <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. Look, y'all. Am I really here? Yep. I think so. I can smell your breath. <laughs> 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 That's so. your upper lip. <laughs> Irritating. But man, y'all, this was good. Yo, we threw down. But look, y'all, man. My hands are messy. Make sure y'all get that seasoning. I'm mm -hmm. not going to lie to y'all. Really, <clears throat> really, really, really good. 10 out of 10. You got to try that again. So... I'm going to keep it real. Like, it's good. I say it's a 10, but, but give your honest opinion. It got a little salt. It's a little salt. It's a little salty. It's a little salty. Is it? Just a tad bit, yeah. It's say 4% sodium. Babe, good one. Okay. Well, I think it's a little salty. You probably tasting the butter. I ain't use a lot of butter, but. So, what's the salty taste? Are you trying to say it's not that seasoning? Because I feel like it is. It's 4% seasoning. I mean salt. Okay, so I said it's a little, it's a tad bit. I ain't say, oh my God, it's overly salty. And honestly, like. All right, I, out on a scale of 1 to 10. Uh, I give it a 7 out of 10. A 7. I give it a 10. Chaz give it a 7. So, hey. Y'all, y'all be the ones that, you know. Try it out, see if you like it. I'm not saying not to try it out, but I just want to keep it real. 
She want to keep it real. Yeah, we ain't about to come on here and be like everything a team. You feel me? I'm gonna be like, man, look, throw that out. That's impossible. No, everything can't be a ten. That's when people know you cap it. So I say it's a ten, but I like that she was like, yo. It's oh. <laughs> All right, y'all. So look, um, man, this was a pretty good video. Pretty yeah. good topic. Let us know what, what is your. Go ahead, Otis. No, 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 I'm no. in the control. No, no, no. Okay, let us know in the comment section what is the scariest movie you ever watched as a kid and even now. Let us know in the comment section below. Let's keep this conversation going. And just let you know, we love y'all. We appreciate y'all. Without y'all, there will be no what? Jazz and Otis. Say it with your chest. Jazz and Otis. You feel me? With that being said, how you want to end it? Man, we're going to end it with love, peace, and smooth. Try. Try.